Introducing Macintosh. It does all the things you'd expect a business computer to do. It does a lot of things you wouldn't expect a business computer to do. And it does some things no other business computer has ever done before. Of course, to do all this, you will have to learn to do this. Macintosh, the computer for the rest of us. The development of Macintosh by Apple has been paralleled by the work of leading software developers. It's a great machine. It's a, a step forward in terms of uh, the way it uses graphics and the speed. And uh, This is a machine that a lot of people are going to be able to afford that's a very, very useful machine. Uh, I was enthused. Microsoft doesn't work with new, new hardware very often, but uh, we put a, a team of people on it from the beginning. and. We're planning that over half of our retail sales next year will come from, from Macintosh software. At the back of Macintosh, you'll find two built-in ports for connecting a printer, a modem, or to Apple Bus, Apple's own local area network, as well as a dedicated port for an external disk drive. The image writer printer from Apple is specially designed for Macintosh. By plugging a modem into your Macintosh, you can communicate by telephone with electronic databases and news services. You can also emulate DEC VT100 and IBM 3278 terminals. You can expand the storage capacity of your Macintosh with an external disk drive, just like the one we built in. And if you work with lots of numbers, you'll appreciate the optional numeric keypad. And when you're ready to travel, Macintosh can easily go along. The durable carrying case is strong and waterproof. Your Macintosh, keyboard, mouse, manuals, and software all fit neatly inside. Even fully loaded, the carrying case is light enough to go anywhere you go. The real genius of Macintosh the world's newest personal computer isn't its 32-bit microprocessor or its Lisa technology, or that it captures the power of a mainframe on a board 10 by 10 inches, or even the...